Hey, Bella Buddies, thanks for watching. Okay, you guys, this is the bonus featured members video. And I typically put this over on my sourcing with Bolo Buddies YouTube channel, but I will tell you that I'm getting like less than a thousand views. So I think that's because most of you are not subscribed over there. So I'm going to put the bonus video here, show you what it's like, and ask you to go sub to my Sourcing with Bolo Buddies channel. So let me show you something real quick. Okay, so this is my Sourcing with Bolo Buddies channel, and I just hit 2,000 subscribers. Yay! Thank you, everyone who has subbed. And anyone who has not, please come on over and subscribe. Um, but what I want to show you is I have tons of videos over here, but I also have the bonus video for the featured members. So you'll see featured members. I think there's probably four, maybe five, maybe six over here. And you just look for the ones that say featured member. You can put that in the search bar. I also have a playlist. Um, is Worth Point worth it? You can check that out. Um, but under the playlist, I think it says featured members. So if you want to just come over and see the featured members, you can check those out, but definitely check out some of the other content over here. It is different. Okay. So now this video, basically what I'm going to show you is members of my Bolo Buddies Facebook group. I am going to share one of their big money bolos or an unexpected bolo or something you guys probably don't know about. This is one of my favorite videos to do. Um, if you missed the main one that I put on this channel normally, definitely go check that out. I have two bolos from each person, from each member in that video. And it is just jam packed full of information. But first off, let me show you. This is my main channel. And this is the um, last month's video. 41 big money bolos featured members share eBay bolo items. Be on the lookout. Okay, so down underneath the video, there is a join button. If you would like to join memberships and be in this video, featured in the video, you do not have to be a YouTuber. Um, you can just share a bolo and then I share your eBay store down in the description. So um, right here, this join button, if you're on a laptop or a computer, that will show up. On your phone, sometimes it does not. So you will have to go down to the description where it says join this channel to access perks. And I have the actual link. And then if you're a member, I'm gonna share your YouTube channel if you have one and your eBay store down in the description of the video. So basically I'm advertising your um, store or your YouTube channel or both. So this is a great way to get your um, channel or your store out there for other people to see. So. To be in the video, you have to join at Bolo Buddies membership level two, which is $4.99 a month. Now, I will tell you guys that I do other um, bonus things throughout the week um, or throughout the month. So uh, one example is I do this bonus video that I'm doing right now. I am not going to guarantee that I'm going to do that every month. That's just something I've kind of been doing for the past, I don't know, five months, I think. Um, I just did a video called This Is My Bolo, where I had featured members, members of my channel that come on and they do a 60 second clip sharing their bolo, which I love this because you guys get to see their personalities. So go look for that video. It will probably post before this one. And then another thing that I do is in my Bolo Buddies Facebook group, which has, I think it's getting close to 40,000 members, I will share a screenshot uh, and ask people to share their best, let's say, November Bolo. And then they screenshot it and put the info in the comments. Now, if you're a Bolo Buddies member, I'm also going to shout you out during this video. So there are little bonus things that I do just to get you guys more advertising for you guys. So check out memberships, $4.99 a month. It's not bad. You can check with your accountant. I'm guessing it would be into business expense because it's advertising but check with your CPA. All right, you guys, are you ready to see some big money bolos? Let's get started. All right. So 
The first item comes from the Funky Pickle Thrifter. And she just joined membership, so you guys have not met her yet. Um, she is very knowledgeable with jewelry. Like, that's one thing that she really focuses on. Um, but she does do other items also. But definitely go and check out her channel. But the item I'm going to talk to you about in this video is this Elvis TV special reel-to-reel -reel tape. Um, so it's a four track. I know nothing about these things. Can you guys tell I'm like reading the title? Um, she got this for $1 at a yard sale and she sold it for $74.99. The next item comes from the Rebel Reseller and she specializes in plush, but also sells other hard goods. And when I pulled this up, she was at 868 and you guys, I think she's probably like 15 or 20 away from 1k. So um, go and sub her up. Let's get her to 1K if she's not there. I'm betting she's going to be there by the time this video posts, but her content is fantastic. So her bolo is... eBay is really slow to pop up. Okay, I love this. Um, she got this at an estate sale for five bucks and it sold for a best offer of 100. It is an Edward Mobley rubber dog, you guys. Look how cute it is, but it's nothing like where you would think, oh my goodness, that's a hundred dollar dog. hundred bucks, you guys. This is what it looks like on the back of the neck. So definitely be on the lookout for toys. They can definitely be, whoa, what is happening? Um, a big money bolo. Okay. The next item comes from Mindful Recycle and uh, Terry has kind of been slacking on her videos um, she's kind of been taking a YouTube break, but she did, I'm happy to say, just put out a new video, um, just two days ago. So definitely go check that out. She's getting really close to 1k subs subscribers. So let's motivate her and get her to 1k because she is a major bolo finder. And she got this teapot set. Okay. So it's this one. And I think another one, um, she sold as a set and she bought, um, she paid $18 and the set sold for $132. They are really, really cute. Um, so best offer 132. Are they cute with their little faces? Let's see. Um, this is all that's on the bottom. It just says Japan. I'm not sure how she knows their lipper and man. Um, maybe she, um, was able to just image search it and figure that out. So I don't see any markings. I was trying to see, I like to find markings on things and then I know how to, um, how to search for them when I'm at estate sales and garage sales and stuff. Okay. The next item came from Donatella Bottolino and Donna does YouTube selling events on her channel, but she will occasionally list to eBay, but she will tell you that most of the time, the items that she lists on eBay are items that she pretty much knows are going to sell quickly and for good money. And she just puts them on there so that she can be showcased on my channel because she's a featured member. And, um, she's been doing some dumpster diving with her kids. And I will tell you, cracks me up. They're just like laughing the whole time. Not like annoying laughing, but just like it's so cute and it's so good. And the stuff they're finding in these dumpsters. Um, so that's just something she's kind of added to her channel lately. Um, she's trying to get more content on her channel as well as, um, you know, just selling events. But you guys, if you're a reseller and you're looking for inventory, you got to check out her channel. Okay, you ready to see this? You guys are going to be like, what? Okay, or wait, maybe that's on the other video. I can't remember which one's here. Oh, this one's really good too. Okay, so this is Diva. She's a ventriloquist puppet and she is amazing. I mean, look at her. She's fantastic. Look at her expression, her eyelashes, the paint on her face, her lipstick and eye makeup. Everything still looks fantastic. Um, look at her eyes. I mean, just amazing. So it's a puppet, you guys. And she sold this for $325 and 
Donna picks things up at estates. She does a lot of bulk buys. She has people that um, know what she does and they call her to buy stuff. I mean, she has connections all over the place. And I will tell you that most of the time she will not list things on eBay because she does not have time. So you can definitely scoop up some Bolo items over on her YouTube auctions. She did sell one of these puppets on her um, at her auction also. Okay. The next item is from Butterfly Hustles, who just recently hit 1K. Congratulations, Carol. You are so deserving of 1K subscribers and many, many more. So everybody, please go sub her up. She um, has tons of reselling content. She does a lot of thrifting at this place called Value Village. And you guys will not believe the stuff she pulls out of that shop. Um, okay, so what did she find? She found... I apologize. eBay is being really slow to open up that tab. Okay, this Christian Dior, it's vintage. It's a robe, you guys. It's, I think it's, I don't know if it's a, if it's men's or women's. I, I think it's men's. And she picked this up at Value Village, of all places, for $9.99 and took a best offer of $95. And there's the tag. The next item comes from be carried away who also has an amazing channel she um vintage clothing but also vintage hard goods and she will tell you she is a long tail seller which means she is willing to be patient and wait on the bottom or wait on the right buyer she's not like a race to the bottom seller where she's going to price things on the low end of comps and i'm kind of the same way like i feel like the market gets uh really um the prices go down so much because everybody's competing to be the lowest price and then it hurts the value of items. So I'm with Carrie. I wait on the right buyer. Okay. She picked up this photo album, which is a retro photo album from the seventies and it's got um, Zodiac signs on it. And you can see it flips open. And she sold this for $42.99. She picked this up at an estate sale for $1. So um, old photo albums can definitely be a bolo. I sold one on Mercari, I think, for like $75. So um, just certain people are looking for certain things. And if you've got it, they are willing to pay up for it if it's what they want. Okay, so this one comes from Sisters Rescued Treasures eBay store. They do not have a YouTube channel. So they do have fantastic items in their eBay store. So you can go and check them out. That will be linked down in the description of the video. And they sold this Michael Harvey vase craft paper bag ceramic art. So you guys, this is not a paper bag. This is a ceramic bag, which is kind of fun, right? Um, they got this at DAV. I know somebody told me what that stood for. Um, in the last video, but I cannot remember. I, I'm guessing it's um, a thrift store of some type, but they sold it for $4.99 and they had it up for auction and it sold for $59 plus shipping. The next item comes from Anytime Picker, who has lots and lots of content on his channel, reseller content. Um, he recently went to a garage sale and talked to this guy who does not sell on eBay anymore, but if you want the scoop, Definitely go check out that video. Um, the guy was just kind of explaining his experience and what he does now for a living and all of that. And he also went to the prison to profit convention and he's got a video on that. So if you guys heard about that and you want to know more, um, a lot of the YouTubers that went are posting videos. So he does have content on that as well. Okay, what he sold. He sold this solitaire handheld game. These are definitely a bolo. Um, if you can find them new sealed in the package, they go for even more. But this sold for $49.99 and he got it at a garage sale for $1. And this is what the back looks like. And there it is. The next item was sold by Chosen Goods Reseller. And Chosen Goods Reseller recently started a live show, you guys. And it's on Thursday mornings at, okay, it's I get it mixed up because I always try to figure out her time and my time because she's a different uh, time zone than me. Let me think. Is it 12 o'clock Eastern Standard Time, I think? And I think it's, yeah, it's 12 o'clock because I usually do a premiere right before it. 
Yeah. So 12 o'clock and it's 11 o'clock her time. So I'm always confused. But anyway, um, also you guys, Carissa chosen goods reseller won the, um, the challenge that I had for the, this is my bolo, the first one, <clears throat> excuse me. And she's starting to open up her packages. So if you want to see her winnings, go and check out this video right here. And um, I think she has two other videos coming soon with the other items she got, but I will tell you, she cleaned up on the first round and somebody made her the most amazing gift. So check out that video to see what it was. All right. She sold this adorable Tigger and Pooh. Um, I should say it's Tigger from Pooh, Winnie the Pooh. It's a stapler, you guys. How cute is that? Now, I definitely would have scooped this little guy up. She got this at the Goodwill for $2.99 and it sold for $24.87 plus shipping. The next item comes from Jack's Treasures and they sell all kinds of things. And a lot of their items come from storage units. And I know a lot of you guys really enjoy storage unit content. So definitely go over and check them out. They do have other content on their channel um, and occasionally a cat. So go and check them out. And what they sold is really cool. It's a lot of untested vacuum tubes. Uh, this came out of a storage unit and they said it sold in 10 minutes and it sold for, uh, they have pennies in it. So from what I understand, they sold some of these individually and then just decided to lot the rest up and sell them in a bulk lot to somebody else, um, untested as is, and sold for a hundred bucks. The next item comes from Horse and Hair Curiosity Shop. No YouTube channel, just an amazing eBay store. You have got to check out this eBay store. It's amazing. I talk about it every week, but I just love seeing um, the different things that they have listed. Okay. I should say she has listed. Now, this little guy, it's a vintage, tiny ghost paper mache, Halloween, handmade. It's like, I think it's three inches, if I remember correctly. I went down and looked. Yeah, three by 1.75 by 1.75. So it is itty bitty. And somebody just made it. You can see the condition is not perfect. It's from 1999, so not even that old. And, you know, it's got the little crack in the face. You guys, this went for $48 and she picked it up at an estate sale for four bucks. So definitely, definitely, definitely keep an eye out for vintage Halloween. And I do have a Bolo category video on this channel about vintage Halloween items. So give that a, give that a search. All right. Neat finds from Naomi. Also no um, YouTube channel, but a fantastic store, just a wide variety of different items that she has listed in her store. Really cool uh, vintage clothing. And what did she sell? She sold this hat. It is a vintage Jack McConnell red feather faux, or it's a feather, let's see, faux gold, faux gold, jeweled trim hat. Check it out. So it is vintage. It's super cool. You know, I got to say that I usually pass on hats like this and she has like made me think I need to look them up. Um, she got this at Amvets for $4 and took a best offer of 80. So vintage hats. The next one comes from the Philly flipper. I guess he's just the Philly flipper. But anyway, you guys, he is like doing super, super well with his garage sale videos. His editing skills are amazing. He's doing things that other YouTubers are not doing. So definitely go and check him out. Um, what did he sell? He sold this lawn chair. If you guys don't know about these, these old vintage lawn chairs are definitely a bolo. He picked this up at a yard sale for $2 and took a best offer of 80. Now, I would probably have passed on this because I wouldn't want to ship it. Um, it just seems like a big pain. But this one even, like, don't those, is it missing a strap or is it really just that wide of an area? It's kind of weird, right? Does anybody know? Let me know in the comments. But that's what he sold. It's an old beach chair, lounge chair. 
It's got the pastel colors. I'm wondering if that helped. The next item comes from Toledo Antique. And Toledo Antique does a lot of selling events. Uh, they just got back from vacation. So you can see they did add some um, YouTube shorts of some of the things that they, uh, the places they visited. That is not their normal content. Their normal content is live selling events and reseller content. So definitely scroll down a little bit if you're not interested in seeing their vacation to get to the reseller content. All right, you guys, what did they sell? They sold this lion car hood ornament and it's pretty cool. Check it out. They got this um, actually at an auction for $25. And you know what? They didn't tell me what it sold for, but they typically do not take too much off. So I'm going to have to say probably between 80 and 100. Um, but I don't know for sure. I apologize um, that I didn't get that information for you guys. The next item that sold is from a little bluebird. And she's not really doing much with her YouTube channel. Every once in a while, she will post. But um, do check out her eBay store. It is listed down below. And she sold this Captain America and the Avengers Nintendo Entertainment System from 1991. It's a game. Um, she did this one on consignment, and it was a 50-50 split. And this Nintendo game sold for $56.50. I will tell you guys that some of these can go for huge money and some of them are bread and butter, but definitely look them up. If you see them, the old cartridges like this, look them up. You may be really surprised. The next one comes from Franklin Hills Hill Ventures, and he specializes in selling on multiple platforms, but he also has, I think he has multiple booths. Um, where he sells things like, um, I don't know what they're called, not like a flea market, but uh, like kind of a flea market style, but a booth where you go in and there's lots of vendors. He has booths. And um, he has sent me some bolo items that he sold in his booth. So there is something to say for that. And I think getting um, big items do well in booths that you can't really sell on eBay. But anyway, check him out for more information. And it's a really pretty vase. And it sold for a best offer of $40 and he paid $10 for it. All right. The next item comes from the Thrifty Broad. She has changed her YouTube name like, uh, I don't know, two or three times lately. Hold on. I've got to circle something over here so I can remember to check something. Okay. So she took a break from YouTube and I think she... It's like six months. And then two weeks ago, she has four new videos up, you guys. And she's talking about online consignment and what she sold on different platforms. So definitely go and check her out. Um, and let's see her bolo. Her bolo is these Tory Birch wedge shoes with a little peep toe here. Um, looks like they're a size seven and a half. And she got these from the Goodwill bins for approximately $2 and sold them for $43 and uh, best offer. So that, that was a pretty good offer, $43. Um, she buys a ton of stuff at the bins. She finds some really nice stuff. Can you believe those came out of the Goodwill bins? So if you don't know what the Goodwill bins are, oh my goodness, go uh, put in the search bar bins on my channel and you can watch me dig through some bins. It's unbelievable. I don't even look at the shoes, but maybe I should. The next item comes from Auctions for You. And T also, um, her and Donatella Bottolino, who I showed earlier, they do YouTube auctions and YouTube selling events together. They go back and forth on each other's channels, but definitely check her out. I have bought some amazing stuff from T. I have unboxings on my channel if you want to check that out. And what did she sell? She sold this. Lego DC Universe, new in the box, factory sealed Lego set. Um, she bought a storage unit full of toys. So I know that's where this came from. She sold it for $89.99. Anytime you guys can find sealed toys, always look them up. The next item is from Money Making Mama. And she specializes in lotting things up that she buys retail arbitrage and selling them for big money. Um, 
it's pretty unbelievable. Uh, I think, I don't know if Dirt Cheap is like a pallet store or what, but I don't have a Dirt Cheap near me. Maybe you do. If you do, definitely check her out for some tips. All right. She sold. Okay. And this came from Dirt Cheap. So she did pay $12 for these, you guys. And she has sold three. Well, you know what? Maybe she's sold more now because it says she only has one left. Okay. So it's, I always want to say Funko. It's Funko. These Funko Pop Target exclusive Britney Spears extra large t-shirt and the vinyl figure. So these were only sold at Target, but now they're at her dirt cheap store and she paid 12 bucks each, which me, I'd be like $12. That's crazy. I'm not paying $12, but you guys, she's selling them for $69 and 97 cents each. So that's a pretty good return um, for an RA. All right. The next item comes from Yard Sales and Dreams, Danielle. And Danielle is a bolo finder. Um, she also has really fantastic content. You guys are definitely going to learn from her channel. You have got to go watch this um, Mr. Potato Head. I'm, I'm not sure. I think that's the one. I, I watched one of them. I think it was this one. And she actually shows you the Mr. Potato Head. Just go watch it. You'll see what I mean if you watch it. It's unbelievable. I don't want to give away the video. Okay. And she picked up this little pet shop at a thrift store for $14 and it sold for 90. Now this is used. It just has the original box and you can see the box is pretty beat up, but you guys, she sold it for 90 bucks. So that is fantastic. It's from 2011. The next item comes from Thrifty Nurse and she sold something cool. So check her out. And she, you guys, she has tons of reseller content. Every once in a while, she pops in something that really doesn't have to do with reselling like this, but um, not, not a whole lot. But she also tests products on her channel. But you guys, go for the meat. Go for these videos that have all of the stuff on them because they are full of reseller bolo content. Um, she is fantastic. These right here are just, um, I think testing products. So, um, okay. Here's what she sold. You guys check this out. It's so cute. It's a vintage Fisher price plush. So when we think of Fisher price, we don't usually think of the high dollar vintage items. And she sold this for $62 and 50 cents, you guys. And she got it at a thrift store for 50 cents. So pretty, pretty cool. He's pretty cute, right? And there's the tape measure. That's what I do too. I'll just throw a tape measure. Okay. The next item comes from Noel Farm Girl Scavenger, or I guess it's Farm Girl Scavenger Noel. And you guys, Noel is so knowledgeable on so many things. You've got to check out her channel. Um, super, super knowledgeable. And she, oh boy, wait till you see this. First off, you got to go see, does money grow on trees? Cause she's going to show you an unexpected way that she makes money. And she talks about Tupperware. She like my Bolo category videos. She kind of does stuff like that only on her channel. She does it like a live show event, but you guys packed with information. So definitely check her out. Okay. Um, she sold this Christopher Radko Christmas ornament, you guys, for $279.99. She picked it up in a bulk buy at an estate sale. And when she broke it down, it came to about a dollar, I think it's a dollar seventy-five or a dollar twenty-five per item, you guys, and it sold for $279. Christopher Radko is definitely an item to be on the lookout for. They do range. Um, from bread and butter to big money, but look them up if you find them. Um, I have done very well with Christopher Radko. The next item comes from Nikki Love Snacks. And um, I just love her YouTube channel name, but I feel like it's a little bit of a tongue twister. So she has a little bit of a mix on her channel, but lots of reseller content also. But um, anyway, Go and check her out. Come dig with us at a thrift store. Um, there was one that I watched. I'm trying to find it. 
it was a um a what sold but i'm not seeing it and she had a really cool way that she um showcased it maybe i just um pulled this up before she posted that video but definitely look at that what sold because it was really neat how she displayed her items it was really different from anything i've seen okay here's what she sold the, she sold this vintage bamboo flatware silverware made in japan fantastic super cool love this look how she packaged it wonder if they came that way or if she did that if she did that that's some fancy packaging i they must have come that way there's no way she made that um i am i am curious though um okay so she got this at a charity shop and she got it for twenty dollars and it sold on auction for two hundred and twenty five dollars plus shipping all right you guys again head on over to my sourcing with bolo buddies youtube channel the link is down in the description of the video um you can find more of these videos over there again i don't normally post them on this video uh, oh my goodness i don't normally post them on this channel this is normally the bonus video that goes on my other channel so thank you for being here thank you for watching if you'd like to become a member awesome if not Keep coming around. Keep watching. All of my content is free. The memberships are for perks. So um, it's just so you can get that extra um, advertising exposure for your eBay store. And it's kind of a fun way to do it or your YouTube channel. All right, you guys. Thanks for watching.